I did nothing to you! Finish the cunt!
Are you fucking high? How's Biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up, and so my prices. Coincidence? <laughs> you decide. Let's see what's good. Take your pick.
Regina sent me. I can tell you. I know you here. Where are you? Huh? Where? How? You alive? Shh. Not so loud. That psycho. You deal with her? Sure did. You can come out now. Finally. Man, I thought suffocating there. You know when you open your eyes in the morning and think this is gonna be a shitty day? That nothing will go the way it should? Well, this was one of those days. Wished I just stayed in bed. The other girl, the one upstairs, she's alive, but she's in a bad way, bleeding. You think you can put her back together? I can't, but Regina will send someone around. It'll all be okay. Why'd that girl blow a fuse? Why do people get cyberpsychosis? Who the fuck knows? And nobody's too keen on finding out. Well, that's my job done then. Till next time. Next time? Fucking hope not. Nicely done. Tal's very happy. Talks about you non-stop. Only good things, of course. And remember, V, word gets around. Closing the gig. So, the girl. Dad, I know. We're synced on the same net. <coughs> you had no choice. Don't... Don't sweat it. The hell happened here? How was supposed to... To crack a BD for us? And he did. <coughs> At least he said so. But it all went sideways. And Annie dove into it. Never heard her scream like that before. She snapped. <coughs> well, you can guess the rest.
Yeah, por fin. Let me hear what you squared away. Then an arch? Oh, damn. What a beaut. Yeah, got her cheap, too. Dorset job dividend. Hmm. Don't know how you could scrape together enough for that beast. Even used. Well, I, I took out a loan, but muy pequeñito. But I mean, it's totally worth it. I'd swap out that tailpipe if I were you. Really? Why? It's got a mean growl that the chicas just love. What that growl does is tell people a mile out that Jackie's rumbling their way. I'd tinker with the fuel injection too, upload a new map, and slap on some thermal tape till you cobble together enough eddies to get that exhaust modded. Mm hmm. Gonna be long? T-Book show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date, fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. Been waiting long? Mi madre always said patience pays off, so... So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? We buy it. I got the Eddies. Did you just say Dex already forked over? So we pay again. Keep trouble to a minimum. So, into the Borg Beast then? Give me a minute. Okay, tell me when you're good and steeled. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these. Borg fuckers. Just had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Uh, cozy place. They could use a few plants, though. Oh yeah. They look damn well prepared. I don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Yeah, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat.
anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. He will deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah. You talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. Uh, well, shit. Goes for you, too. I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. See your ass down for a planet bullet in your skull. Jack, sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well, all right. Come on. Gotta lighten up. Take a hit. What is it? A skeef. Shit kicks you in the ass. It's a fucking rush, man. Gotta feel it for yourself. Come on, give it a whirl. Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, straight-edged princess. Here we go. A flathead. Model MT Zero D12. Militech's not gonna come looking for it. Fuck 'em. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift it access locks using our soft. What's yours is yours. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Raven's not the dedicated control unit for a flathead. Ha! Of course not! 
Militech controllers auto link to Militech systems. I mean, you wouldn't want them tracking their stolen tech back to your hands. Yeah, Raven's our baby. Got improved neural sync and no fucking pesky tracing. You ask me, we ought to sell that shit. It'll have to do. <laughs> Look at that. Picky little fucker. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? I'm talking to you! Fuck Brick, then. Let's cut a new deal. Now that's good business sense. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica. <laughs> he ain't dead. So you're gonna consider my offer now? I don't Here wait. Here you go. Paid in full. trick for you, whatever the trick is. Now take the damn bot and get the fuck out of my factory. And you can tell Dex to suck my shiny chrome cock. Got what we came for. Nova, so now leave. And hey, after you get Dex's dick out of your mouth, tell him I say hello. <laughs> Piece of shit. Alright. Better show you guys out. What the hell for? We know the way. Easy, compadre. You'll be outside in no time. Get in. know you're loyal. Doubt he ever gives shit like that a thought. Know what he believes in? What drives him? Chaos. Break. Predictable. He said a thing, he did that thing. With Royce, you're in your toes, always guessing. I mean, he could blast your face off at any time. Who knows? No one. Yeah, sounds like a natural-born leader. Where to now? Bjorn, look. Tell them to meet some new friends. Fuck off! <laughs> Giving tours now, Dum Dum? Yeah. Gonna show them your dildo collection. The fuck you looking at me, Sam? Now shut it and get back to work. Well, think that's everything. Fucking Militech! If I had it my way, we'd scrap each and every one of them. Seeing how much scratch you'd make off of them, I figured you'd like them more. What? Got a chip or two loose, you know that? And, uh, avoid coming back. It's good advice. Repeat business, not really our thing. That guy rubbed my dick the wrong way. Dum dum? What the fuck kind of nick is that anyway? No 
begging, no debt, no corporal strings attached. And the flathead's ours. <laughs> That's the way to do biz, V. Uh, sometimes it is, sometimes it isn't. Got lucky today. Well, ain't you a ray of sunshine? But V, it ain't a matter of luck. You decide. Remember that. Ah, I love this town. The city of endless opportunity and brotherly hate. But if you got the cojones and you know how to use them, you can do damn near anything. Unless you catch a boat, stray or not. Even then, you go out with a bang, right? And the street will talk. The street will remember. It's only a man. You know, you can make heaps more eddies as a motivational speaker. Hold on, dig away. What now, Jack? What now? And now I go back. Find Misty. We do something to make me feel alive again. They could have shot us up good back there. No two ways about it. Catch a fright back there, that you wouldn't make it back. <laughs> Shit like that don't cross my mind. But I am grateful for coming through. Don't forget to let Dex know we got his toy for him. Ahí lo veo. How things looking, Mr. V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on it. How'd you get him on board? You used the Corpo woman? Did it without Militech holding my hand. Didn't want to risk it. Paid out of my own pocket. That bot ain't no bargain basement tech. That it is not. You got some balls, Mr. B. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Mr. B.
que ya tengo planes para esta noche. Sí, mamá. Te vas a enterar mañana. Yo también te quiero, ma. Yeah, about time, Holmes. What's new with Senora Wells? Uh, you know, she's worried about me. <laughs> Whatever. Can't help herself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! The afterlife. Known far and wide, that name. Oh, yeah? Some of the Nomad Clan's biggest jobs are scored right here. Don't surprise me. Ain't no better place than Night City to land a gig. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! Uh, later then. Place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Who would have thunk? I know, right? Way before our time, that. But proper burials were still a thing. This is a fucking world! What, huh? The NGPD has expanded the costume to include the Name's V. This is Jackie Wells. Oh. Is that supposed to sound familiar? It will soon. We're here to see Dex. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. Susan Forrest, Boa Boa, maybe even Morgan Blackhead. Hey, grab a seat. We'll begin a sec. Looks like we're up. That's Rogue. Best fixer in all of Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? You order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. Duo of Johnny Silverhands coming up. Right on, chica. Somebody did their homework. Looks like the dog ate mine. Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. Say I wanted a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Snuff it. Mind blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. Ah, what a beautiful tradition. Guess dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. I live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. To being filthy rich. Filthy rich legends. Oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer, oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> I'll remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. 
Mr. Deshaun, see you now. How do you know? My job to know. Look around. How do you think mercs earn their reps? Through gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's how. Dex a regular? You come here a lot? A sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. Didn't show his face for nearly two years. Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. Guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. Bad time to choke and shoot your bridges, Joel. Come on. Love to hang. Break a leg. Like the vibe, but thanks. We got an important meeting. This way. Same here. No, in the ring. Just some kind of exotic shit. Kempo, Jiu Jitsu. Think you could take me? Drop me? Sure. This dip pinch it. In here. Whoa, gotta take a piss? In here. That's right, Excelsior. Cold hard eddies as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it ain't Mr. V. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead? Let's see this bad boy. Uh, Mr. V? Alright then. Set your butts down comfy. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Now, now, Mr. Wells is right. We're gonna be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Mr. V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? Well, as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza inside from that raw BD she scrolled. Mm-hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target. Yorinobu Arisaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm-hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? So she just want to see what's good, or was there something else? Hello? was something else. Parker made me another offer. Another offer? Mm-hmm. Kind where we ditched the middleman and split the pot in even 50-50. What? <clears throat> Ditch the middleman? <laughs> Shit, now that's rich. <laughs> Clients never learn, do they? I do appreciate you sharing this info, though, Mr. V. You see, trust is essential in any partnership that's to be long-lasting and fruitful. Thought you'd be pissed that you'd lose it. Lived in NC too long to blow my top every time some amateur thinks they can take me for a ride. Parker ain't the first and sure as hell won't be the last. Appreciation don't convert to eddies, 
and Evelyn offered us a bunch. He's telling it like it is, Dex. Y'all need not worry, truly. We'll come to that. How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deeds. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. A Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. It goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. Transport's at Delamain. Primus Cab Company in all night city. Not a mall. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The No-Tell Motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Osaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? How do we get in the penthouse? Yarnobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Konpeki's dweller, elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Trust me when I say whatever hit you think of, T-Bug solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to... take a break. Flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? Okay, feel brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Now's a good time as any. Fresh talent gets 30% always. But I'm willing to make an exception in your case. I'm gonna cut you a nice juicy 40 as a bonus for your honest DV. Appreciate it, Dex. Even though the Yetis aren't most important to me. Interesting. So what does qualify as most important? It's about the challenge. Always. Look at you youngins making us old folk look bad. Last thing. Kempeki's got a strict no-iron policy, security gates, the works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride, take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part, too. Chido. Thanks, T. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role, but a week, two tops is my guess. What do we do while waiting? Sit around, suck air. You sit tight, heads down, cause old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet, so don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. My cue to Delta Two. Gotta prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. 
Any other issues, now's your chance. Thanks for your help back at the scav haunt. A few Reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. You and Dex know each other a while? Um, why? Uh, you know, peeps say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophize in it. No wonder you get along. Plan. What's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. I'm good. No questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Something I gotta take care of first. Sin problemas. Meet you by the Delamain. Just don't forget to suit up. <laughs> 